YouTube, I'm Case. Today I'm bringing you a brand new video. We're going to be talking about Black Ops 3 contracts, something everyone loves to talk about. So let's hop straight into it. So recently, Charlie Intel actually put out a tweet stating what's on the screen right now about no more contracts. And I made a video about this before saying like why they should add more contracts. And it seemed like a lot of people actually wanted it as well. So with them doing this, they're making the community happy. Well, most of it, I should say. I can't speak for the whole community, but they're making most of it pretty happy. Now, as of today, as of the moment I'm recording this, we have no further information about it. We don't know when it's exactly coming out. We don't know exactly what the challenges or contracts are going to be. Because uh, recently it was like you get one bribe or something, or you're guaranteed a DLC weapon. And then you get like a certain amount of supply drops. And that's what it was before. Now they might change it up a little bit. They might add some stuff. But really, we don't know anything. Even Charlie Intel, we don't, no one knows. Uh, they might come out with something really cool, like getting a certain amount of headshots with a submachine gun or something crazy. Like that'll just get people like going for it and trying. Um, they might make it some sort of objective thing as well because I know they like to base this game over objectives and they want people to play objective. So they also might do that. I think it's just very exciting with these contracts because it gives you something to actually go for while playing the game. Um, you, there's a ton of stuff to go for in this game. Dark Matter, uh, you know, Specialist. Um, I forgot what it's called. But there's like specialist gear and stuff like that hero gear and i think this will be just another addition because people like to go for dark matter diamond gold whatever but now they can go for contracts they can grind out the game on the weekends even though it's wednesday but we can grind out the games on the weekends and try to get as much as we can now one of my hopes is that they actually do make it on the weekends because if so that'd be really really fun to live stream and record for you guys just grinding out call of duty to get some more content it's just a very cool concept that they're actually listening to the community you know some of the community they wanted this to come back because a lot of people which i didn't but they completed their 75 wins and they did that in the matter of a day i know someone ocean hey um but they did that in the matter of a day and they just want more um, because it's something really to go for and I think it's something really good to go for because no one likes getting like bad stuff from supply drops so we're going to try as much as we can you know if we're playing games yeah hack be it I'd rather play games to get supply drops than you know have to pay for it that's just not my thing I mean other people might think different but that's just my thing you know, we can try to play and win supply drops, what it's kind of meant to be for. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you guys did, make sure you smash that like button down below. I really do appreciate it. Hit that subscribe button. It means the world to me. Let me know what you guys think down in the comment section about these contracts. If you guys stuck to this part of the video, in the comments put hashtag contracts are back. If you guys did, uh, I would love to see that. And yeah, let me know your hype for these contracts. I hope you guys have yourselves a great day. Let's aim for 50 likes. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out.